I wonder what kind of lunch my mom would have made me. <gasps> Maybe actual space cookies! <sighs> I just wish I knew a little more about her. But I want to see my mom. Hello, Steven. Um, it's... it's nice to meet you. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, too. For me? Who would put this here? We can't both exist. I'm going to become half of you. And I need you to know that every moment you love being yourself, that's me loving you and loving being you because you're going to be something extraordinary. You're going to be a human being. Hey, Rose! Take care of them, Stephen. Is that mom? Oh, 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 I'm getting emotional. I think it's happening. Uh, I'm really feeling it. Oh, come on, I had it. Steven, it's fine. Just, just stay here and watch Amethyst. We'll find out what's wrong with the fountain. No, no, wait, I can still do it. Wait, wait, it might still happen. Guys? Ah! Why, well, hold it. I can't understand you. I don't understand anything. Why is everyone acting so strange? Why can't I? It's just, I mean, I don't know how to feel about you, but everybody else does. I wish I could have met you. Then this place could make me sad. And I could cry healing tears. Like you. This guy, saving my life in junk. <laughs> I've been, uh, thinking about you a lot lately. More than usual. Is that so? Yeah, well, for my whole life, I've been hearing stories about you. About how amazing you were, that you were so kind and loving. And every time I'd see the painting of you hanging in the temple, I'd be inspired and reminded of how much I had to live up to. I, uh, I've even thought about dyeing my hair pink more than once. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with your hair. It's wonderful just the way it is. Wonderful in every way, just like you. Wow, this is nice. It's, it's really nice. I, I should have tried this a long time ago. But Steven, don't you realize we've been together this whole time? Oh, <laughs> that's, that, that's right. <laughs> Family stuff is tricky. Mm -hmm. And then I found out that the gems are alien rebels and that there are other gems out in space that want us dead because they think we're traitors. And they tried to take me hostage because they think I'm my mom. And maybe I kind of am? I wish I could talk to Garn and Amethyst and Pearl about it, but I think they kind of blame me for my mom not being around. Oh no! Uh, ah! What's going on? It's some kind of magic moss my mom planted! Wait, your mom? Guys, hang on! <laughs> <laughs> 
<gasps> Lars, I know what we have to do. This is all your fault. <sighs> I knew if something went wrong today, it would be because of you. Now I'm never going to be friends with these guys, all because of your weird mom. What do you know about my mom? I didn't even get to know my mom! But I do know she saw beauty in everything, even in stuff like this! I'm getting stuck! was just trying to bloom. <sighs> I can't even be the one thing I'm supposed to be, you know? Of course I do. I'm not Rose Quartz. Oh, no. Oh, Steven. Why do you think I've been working so hard? Well, it's paying off. <laughs> Everybody always tells me how great Mom was. I just don't feel like I can ever measure up to her. <laughs> I can't believe this. That I'm the one giving the pep talk to Rose's... Rose's... Son. Right. You are different. That's what's so exciting. You don't have to be like Rose Quartz. You can be someone even better. You can be you. I'm sorry, Bismuth, but it's not right. That's exactly what she said. Huh? That's exactly what you said. Um, uh... It is you, isn't it, Rose? Well, what are you talking about? Don't lie to me. You can't expect me to believe you now. After you lied about everything, you're lying about this new form, just like you lied to the others about me! But I didn't just disappear, did I? You know what happened to me! Wait, I'm not my mom. I don't know what she did, but I'm sure she didn't want to hurt you. You bubbled me away and didn't ever tell your friends. My friends. I'm going to tell them. I'm going to tell them everything. <laughs> then you really are better than her. Was a tragedy what happened to her. Who is that anyway? Were you made yesterday? That is Pink Diamond. Earth was Pink Diamond's colony. Everything was going smoothly at first. I was there. I saw it with my own eye. I watched the lead of the Crystal Gems Rose Quartz shatter Pink Diamond. No. Rose Quartz would never do that. And sure, she had to fight, but... But she would never shatter someone! Does this have something to do with Pink Diamond? I already know Mom shattered her, so what is it about this that you can't tell me? Please, you're making Pearl very upset. I'm sick of everyone lying to me! Rose is my mom! Out of anyone! Don't I deserve to know the truth? Rose Quartz. <laughs> I never thought I'd get a chance like this. I can't believe you're all mine! Huh? You're right. Why are you attacking me? So next, surprise! Rose Quartz, you shattered a diamond! Oh, oh, oh. Ah! I've learned things about you. Things you wanted to keep secret. You locked Bismuth away inside Lion because she wanted to shatter gems, and you never told Garnet or Pearl. But then you shattered Pink Diamond. Now all of Homeworld has it out for Earth and the Crystal Gems and me. You put us all in danger and you just disappeared. I finally know the truth. I know what you are! You're a liar! I thought you never wanted to hurt anyone, but you hurt everyone! How could you just leave Garnet and Amethyst and Pearl and... and Dad? They don't know what 
to do without you. Maybe they didn't matter to you as much as hiding from the mess you made. And that's why I'm here, isn't it? Did you make me just so you wouldn't have to deal with all your mistakes? Is that all I'm here for? I get it. I know you didn't want me to deal with your problems. But you're a part of me now. I have to deal with what you left behind. I'm someone the Diamonds will want more than any of these humans. The leader of the Crystal Gem Rebellion. The gem that shattered Pink Diamond. I'm not my dad. I'm my mom. I'm Rose Quartz. Steven? No, don't. Steven! What are you doing? I get it now. I'm the only one who can stop what she started. I can stop all of it. You're wrong. Steven, get down here. I am Rose Quartz, and I'm guilty. Wait. Everything you guys said I did, I did. And I did it by myself. I'm sorry. I'll accept any punishment you want to give me. What is it, Steven? You remember how Mom shattered Pink Diamond? Well, I was just wondering if maybe... You shattered Pink Diamond. I... I can't believe I'm going to do this. I can't exactly shatter myself. Convincing? Very much so, my diamond. Soon it will be just Rose. Wait, there's one last thing I need to do. Yes? No one can ever find out we did this. I never want to look back. So, for my last order to you as a diamond, please, let's never speak of this again. No one can know. No. I wanted to tell you for so long. Mom was Pink Diamond. What? So. Pink Diamond, huh? Yep. Wow. Oh. Rose Quartz, eh? Mm-hmm. So, all this time, we thought Rose was this rebel leader, but she was just rebelling against herself? Apparently. And the diamond that Rose supposedly shattered. I mean, you've got it. It's right there under your shirt. Yeah. So, how you feeling? I feel confused. I, I thought I'd, I'd really finally got it. That mom didn't have everything figured out, even though everyone put her way up on this pedestal. But now I guess she's royalty too? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm relieved that she didn't shatter anyone, but she lied to everyone. I mean, I'm not surprised. I knew she was a liar. But this is just... so much. But, like, aren't you mad? Kind of? I don't know. I can see how she was good and bad, and bad and good, but I, I guess what really matters right now is how hard Garnet took it. But what about you? She's your mom. You were always under all this pressure to be like her, but was she even like her? My mom kept it secret from everyone. What are you talking about? Pink Diamond took the form of Rose Quartz permanently after faking her shattering. Then Rose Quartz gave up that form to create a new life with my dad, me. Rose passed her gemstone and some of her powers onto me, but that's all. I... I don't have any of Pink or Rose's memories. I'm sorry. 
Hmm. I'm sure your memories are in there somewhere, Pink. Actually, I go by Steven. Whoa! Maybe things won't be so bad. <gasps> it's White's Pearl. Pink Diamond, your presence is required. Uh, maybe we could... <gasps> There you are. Hello, Starlight. You certainly gave everyone a scare. They're all just thrilled to see you safe and sound. Um, hi. I... As for this latest little game of yours, thank the stars it's over. Did you have fun? Did you get everything out of your system? I... Good, good. Everyone is so relieved. Welcome home, Pink. Like something I used to do. Familiar, she used to throw a tantrum. Insisting, hey, I'm a diamond too. I bet she drove them crazy all the time. They love her, but they're leaving her behind. With more important places they should be. Someone just like me Familiar That's why it's so familiar Familiar Like someone I used to be Familiar But this time I've had some practice And helping a struggling family Oh, I'll get them all together why you defend their flaws? I know why, Pink. You like surrounding yourself with inferior gems. What? You enable their terrible behavior so you can be the best of the worst. That's not true! And even if it is, even if it was, you're talking about my mom. You're not talking about me! <laughs> you became Rose Quartz to deceive your pathetic friends, and now you've improved on that because you're even deceiving yourself. No, you're wrong. I'm not my mom. But don't you know things about her that you couldn't possibly know? I, I've just been connecting with her. My powers, they, they help me connect to others. I'm not her. I'm just feeling her feelings. You can hide from yourself, but you can't hide from me, Pink. Now, Starlight, this has gone on long enough. It's time to come out, Pink. What is this? Where is Pink? She's gone. What did you say? Answer me! She's gone! Where do you think 
you're going. That's enough! at me I only want you to be yourself if you can't do that I'll do it for you back. I can't believe Mom did that to you. Actually, I can totally believe it. You're not the only one she hurt. <laughs> yeah, you must know all about her life without me. Rub it in, why don't you? No, it's not like that. You deserve a better friend. Welcome, Pink Diamond. Uh, no. I'm Steven Universe. Welcome, Steven Universe. Pink did this. What did you say? Pearl, no. It's a funny story, really. Once Pink got tired of asking Yellow and Blue for her own colony, so she went straight to White. Of course, White told her she wasn't fit to run one, and well, that set her off. Set her off? What are you talking about? You remember how she was, with her destructive powers throwing tantrums left and right? She had a screen that could crack the walls. She didn't mean to hurt me. <laughs> I just happened to be standing too close to her that time, and- Doesn't matter! I'm gonna fix it! Destructive powers? Pink didn't have destructive powers. She was a healer. She didn't throw tantrums. She kept her feelings secret. The pink I knew couldn't keep a secret to save her gem. Are you kidding? If anything, she was too good at keeping secrets, even from me. Uh, stop it! I can't deal with one more horrible thing she did, okay? I just wanted to fix it! Uh. <laughs> Hello, Steven! Sorry you surprised me, but it, it's fine. Maybe we should get back. We don't want to wear out our welcome. But we're having so much fun. Do you not want us here? What? No, you're, you're totally welcome here. You... you should stay over. For the night? Mm, slumber party! I'm dying! I'm dying! I am dead! I am dead, Rose Quartz! <laughs> wow! So that's a movie? Let's watch another. Take your pick. How about this one? This is, like, so chill. <laughs> I know, right? Steven, we can't both exist. <laughs> I'm going to become half. Time for bed! We would love to live with you! Uh, I mean, you could, but then a uh, lion might get mad. He could be very territorial and... Uh... Can't you guys take a hint? He doesn't want us to be here. He doesn't like us. What? There's no way that's true, right, Steven? <gasps> Your face! It's not that I don't like you, it's, it's, just, it's just... Wow, he really does hate us. Please, please don't leave like this. I, I'm really sorry. It's not like I don't like you or don't want you here. It's just that you look so much like her, like my mom. I thought I was ready to move on and not have her hanging over me anymore, but I can barely be in a room with you because I still feel all twisted up about her. I've been pretending that I'm fine because it's not your fault, but I'm not fine. We've been pretending too. Huh? Your mom created us too, then got us all bubbled just for being rose quartzes. But you know, it's cool. It's whatever. It's not whatever. I don't expect you to understand. I swore I wouldn't talk about this. But I do understand. Oh, man. If anyone can understand how you feel, it's me. 
I've been thinking about you guys like my mom times three, but we're really more like siblings. Mom created all of us, and we've all been living in her shadow. We'll always be related to her, but that means we'll always be related to each other. That's pretty awesome. I am so glad we're related. Yeah, siblings forever. <laughs> well, feel free to visit if you want. No pressure. Thanks, Steven. Later, Rose Quartz. All right, Mom, where should you go? Yeah! Hmm, how about here? Hmm.